Borneo Jazz Festival edisi ke-17 sudah mula memeriahkan Bandar Raya Biri dengan pelbagai genre muzik yang didendangkan di Koko Cabana Miri. Menurut Menteri Pelancongan Industri Kreatif dan Seni Persembahan, Datuk Seri Abdul Karim Ramban Hamzah berkata Lembaga Pelancongan Sarawak, STB, mensasarkan kehadiran seramai 1,000 penonton setiap malam bermula 24 hingga 26 Jun ini. The festival is also the first time it's being held uh, hybrid, whereby we have it physical as well as it's also being online. online. Uh, for, it's going to be held for three days tonight. It's going to be the first uh, night, and uh, we being quite conservative. Uh, we if we can hit the target of 1,000 per night uh, attendance, we would be very very happy. And I was met. To be informed by by Juan Chazat, the chairman of uh, the CEO of Sarawak uh, Tourism Board, that every night uh, we should be able to hit about 90% of our target. Uh, that is about 900 plus. Uh, Menurut Abdul Karim lagi, konsert dalam talian ini juga dapat memberi peluang kepada penonton yang tidak dapat hadir secara fizikal untuk mengikuti Music Borneo Jazz Festival. That is another avenue, another opportunity for those who could not make it to this uh, physical uh, show. You know, we we do know that uh, there are some countries who still have got restriction uh, in travelling, and even if those uh, restriction might have been loosened. Uh, we do know that there are many who are still fearful about travelling. So, at least that gives them an opportunity to be able to see uh, what is being held out here. Dengan tema pada kali ini, Jazz in the Jungle, pengunjung dari dalam dan luar negara dapat bersama-sama menikmati muzik sambil mengamati pemandangan cantik yang menghadap ke Laut Cina Selatan. Pelbagai aktiviti lain termasuk bengkel boleh disertai pengunjung tidak kira usia selain kraft tangan unik daripada pengusaha kraft tangan tempatan yang dapat dibeli sebagai tanda kenang-kenangan.